Let's go in the Punta Gorda Lighthouse on the Lost Coast Trail of Northern California. There are shipwrecks here and uh, in 1907 there's a big shipwreck that killed over 80 people. The Columbia went down here and killed all those people died and uh, and so they decided to build this lighthouse because of the numerous shipwrecks. And uh, it never had electricity in here. And uh, it, this place remained a remote settlement. And it uh, was in operation until 1951. But it never worked with electricity like most lighthouses have gone to. You can see through here. Window area. We're going to take, we're going to, we'll go ahead and go up the ladder here. Very steep. As you can see right there, it's like going up a ladder to go in here. So you gotta hold on this. This is the Punta Gorda Lighthouse. It's in the King Range, off, right off the coast of the King Range. Very rugged coastline. All right. It's really windy up here. This place is known for high winds and lots of shipwrecks. They had actually several had actual little settlement here, so they had three structures here, along with the actual lighthouse. There were some other buildings here. You can see down there uh, one of the uh, structure pads. Let's go ahead and go out here. Backwards here. Teeny little opening. You have to crawl through it. You know, good. If I weren't holding on this railing, I'd be falling down backwards. It's like a really steep ladder. There we go. And there's the Punta Gorda Lighthouse on the Lost Coast Trail. It's my backpack. There must be a part down there from one of the shipwrecks. If you haven't been here before, you'll notice this fog line out here. That fog line moves in and out from the coast depending on the weather. You see over here, it's really close to the shore and down to the south and moves out further there. <laughs> 